Welcome guys to Alt News TV and we're gonna check out Eternal Evolution over here. An interesting idle RPG that you definitely need to give it a try. So you're going to collect your offline income, obviously you're not have some ads over here. But check out the graphics of this game. Quite, quite awesome man, I mean come on. So let's jump into the story mode. This is how you're going to fight with different kind of enemies. You're going to have up to three classes, three factions, sorry. And obviously you're gonna have tanks, you're gonna have melees, you're gonna have uh, the ones in the back, you're gonna have mages, let's say. But uh, you definitely need to give this game a try if you're a fan of the idle RPG part because the graphics for this game are amazing. Now believe me when I say amazing. So you're gonna have the same style, like you're gonna have campaign mode, you're gonna have different kind of towers that you're going to be able to fulfill in order for you to get different kind of crystals that you're going to need in order for you to level up and go further and further. Now, most probably I'm gonna die due to the fact that I have encountered a problem over here, but I'm gonna try to, uh, let's say, move next time to a different uh, scenario. So, as you can see, I have dragons, I have two rats, I have robots, I have humans. You are going to have a lot of cool, cool things in this game. So definitely give this game a try if you hadn't had the possibility to. But until then, let me show you different kind of tricks. So you're going to have your heroes over here. And as I mentioned, you're going to have three factions. You're going to have Terrans, you're going to have Atlas, and you're going to have Winfear. So let's go over here. Uh, these are the monsters, if I'm saying correctly, different kind of uh, interesting graphics for these ones, but also over here you're going to have something from Earth, let's say. Now, you're going to have the human side over here, as I mentioned, with robots and stuff. Now, you're going to have over here dragons, a different kind of beasts. Uh, from outside our world as you can see although this one looks like a panda but uh, whatever uh, i think he is uh, we're gonna go back uh, we're gonna go in the base over here so you're gonna have the big big base over here that you do need to watch out for so you're, you're gonna discover different kind of new things every time you're gonna enter over here you're gonna have the recruitment center different kind of sss heroes you're gonna have the outpost over here where you're going to send your uh, heroes uh, in different kind of missions and i'm gonna not gonna keep you on that you're gonna have the prototype over here now these are the ones that are going to offer you let's say a bonus regarding the damage and the health so different uh, as you can see over here so hp attack and defense quite cool you're definitely going to use them and we're gonna go in the perimeter over here just to show you guys so we're gonna go over here in this dungeon so you're gonna have desa caves you're gonna have Tara Dome and you're gonna have Sinsaro Marsh. Now, these are basically some dungeons that you do need to watch out for. Now, you can farm over here quite, quite a lot. Uh, not a lot, sorry, three times a day, but you're going to need to check out for the boss because the boss has different kind of skills. Like, for example, this one over here, guys, has the capacity uh, he's capable of absorbing a significant amount of damage. He uses multiple attacks to break the shield as soon as possible. So you need to destroy his shield before he's going to load up uh, his skill. And if you're not going to be able to do that, you're going to receive a high amount of damage. So definitely you kind of need a healer also regarding this boss. Now you do want to watch out for the other ones as well, because as I said, quite, quite difficult ones. And for example, this one over here, I'm going to show you. Uh, let's go in the skill. So when the poisonous exploration starts, all of the venom on the ground will transform into spiders that will start slotting towards the cycle. If you got to prevent them, you got to prevent them, sorry, from entering the circle of all costs. So basically, if they're going to enter over there, they're going to do a lot of damage. You're going to lose the fight and so on. So let's jump into this fight. Uh, I'm going to multiply it with three because I cannot pass to the next one because it's quite hard. This was it, definitely quite quite short, I was expecting something more advanced, but uh, let's see, if I would have challenged him, I would have won, my bad regarding this part, but whatever. So you're gonna have the soul mine, the soul mine is an endless tower that you can fight in, 
the same idea basically the same monsters in different kind of uh, parties and you're going to need to kill them in order for you to advance further and further that's going to be the main idea you do want to check out the story you're going to have different kind of exclusive storylines where you're going to be able to follow a different kind of story uh, definitely that one is quite cool you're gonna see the whole picture of the game quite quite as i mentioned cool graphics quite quite cool heroes you definitely need to merge a lot in this game in order for you to collect all of those uh, ssr ss as heroes that you're going to be able to have because you're going to need to merge quite a lot as i mentioned now regarding this game you need to try it as i mentioned if you're a fan of the idle rpg games please give this game a try don't have so many things to mention regarding this game due to the fact that the same guys the same tips still apply i do not know yet which are the best heroes in this game but definitely if you know and you have a cool cool tip for us please drop them in the comments below i do have atlas one of the best heroes that i think he is uh, hercules is quite quite a huge and big tank so definitely he kind of keeps the enemy away from the backline that i'm having over there the healer panda and so on i am switching from time to time the healer panda with the dragon the dragon definitely does quite quite a lot of damage but you're gonna see that you're going to have quite quite a lot of fun regarding this game because as i mentioned it's quite interesting and has an amazing graphic so you're going to go in the campaign mode you're going to advance further and further it's not gonna be i'm not just gonna hit next you're going to have the auto advance option i'm just gonna exit over here definitely you know how the tower goes so you're just going to go further and further deeper and deeper sorry not further and further because that's a mine you're gonna have the wasteland over here now you do need to watch out for this you're going to have at the third tier the possibility to fight with two teams you can skip this battle so definitely uh, you can uh, pick different kind of heroes over here as well i'm going to go with him because i like him i don't know why but he's cute we're gonna go over here i'm gonna change you and i'm gonna put you over here so here it is i'm just going to hit challenge basically you can skip these battles you're gonna have the skip option for this one but it's gonna be up to you if you're going to watch it i'm just gonna skip it for now so guys don't forget please check out this game if you haven't had the possibility to because definitely it's quite quite awesome and you do want to hit that like button and also subscribe in order for you to know other idle games that i'm gonna post you're gonna have the arena obviously you're going to fight with other players and so on so it's not gonna be that hard i'm not gonna jump into that you're gonna nah the back come on uh, let's go in the perimeter over here so you're gonna have the rift over here so these are the places where you're going to be able to unlock different kind of stories you do want to unlock them quite difficult a bit let's say you do need to move a lot of things in this game in order for you in this part of the game in order for you to unlock everything in those stories but definitely they are worth it so guys if you didn't try this game please let me know and if you're going to start it please do so so you're gonna have the raid over here let's see if uh, i cannot enter this one so i'm gonna start over here basically this is the boss you do want to kill him you're gonna get your gear from here uh, basically you are able to farm him in twice a day so you do want to farm him over here in order for you to get the gear if you're going to have the best gear obviously you're gonna have some advantages you can skip this battle like i'm doing right now as i mentioned quite quite a nice nice graphic to this game let's hope that they will do even more and let's hope that uh, they will introduce different kind of features that you will not see in all other games that you're going to see out there now guys if you have played it as i mentioned and know some tips and some tricks regarding this game please drop a comment and let us know because definitely those are going to be quite quite useful until next time please take care don't forget to subscribe as i mentioned because i'm going to show you different kind of idle games over here on my channel in order for you to know what you do want to play and not just install it now you do want to evolve your heroes as i mentioned so basically you're going to need some copies like in all idle games the same idea until next time guys please take care and smash that like button bye